Hello, welcome to our blog. Uh, this time, let, uh, let's discuss all about uh, waterline layout. So, for this session, let's discuss all about uh, one toilet, uh, common toilet, at saka isang uh, kitchen sink sa kusina. Okay, so to start, meron tayong legend. Okay, this one, waterline legend. Si KS, that is kitchen sink for here then WC water closet uh, lab it's for laboratory then CB for check valve WM water meter uh, ZB for get valve uh, and this line that is for PPR pipe okay this one is for typical ground floor uh, mostly sa bahay Meron tayong CR, okay, and saka this one, um, a kitchen sink, okay. So, we have this one, uh, kitchen sink, uh, let's make a label for this, okay, and then water closet, okay, WC, and then we have laboratory, uh, no, no laboratory okay and then because meron tayong palang laundry in this area so we sure lagyan natin to ng stop out ng tubig okay meron tayo dito ng additional it's B that's for host beef okay so let's place this one to the laundry area so for sure kahit ilagay natin dito that is for uh Yung symbol na yan is it's B or we call as host B. Okay, so complete na tayo with our plumbing fixtures, kitchen sink, water closet, laboratory, at saka host B. Okay, so ngayon, gawa natin ng uh, typical na water line layout. Okay, so for sure, dito yung uh, supply ng Manilad or Manila water from here so means to see dito yung tatlo okay check valve water meter at saka gate valve okay this ito yung section ng bahay pinuto lang natin ito yung galing sa okay Manila water from here okay so from this one itap natin to uh Let's have top to, uh, top to nearest water line or it is to Manila water. Let's put it here or Manila. Okay, it jang kayo sa province, pwede rin water utility. Okay, to Manila water. And then after that. Yung water line layout is, you can piece it here. Ilagay mo rito. Okay. Okay. And then, let's tap it to the main. Ito yung main natin. Okay. After that, let's place a gate bulb from kitchen sink. Pwede ilagay somewhere here. Actually, mas maganda siya rito yun. Uh, sir, pa, bakit may git bulb? The git bulb, the purpose is to shut off or shut on the water line. Pwede ang reason is meron kang maintenance or ipagpulit ka ng fixtures, di magalawin yung iba. Or you can piece it here, yung git bulb. Laboratory. Kahit yung house build, ah, house build, sorry. Meron ding, ah, ah, meron tayong ilagyan na git bulb for maintenance purpose. Or, pwede rin stop out lang. Okay. Git bulb, sa natin ilagay. Mas better sa rito. Okay. It's for, it's because build. Okay. As after that, meron na tayong, ah, uh, git bulb assignment. Let's connect this 
uh, water line pipes okay nagbilis lang to okay and then okay for the succeeding uh, ito na sorry let's connect this uh, to sa ating uh, kitchen sink okay parang balik na to i-flip natin ayan Okay, ito yung ating water line. Tap natin dyan. Okay, so meron lang tubig yung uh, kitchen sink. And then, to supply with this, itong sa comfort room, let's stop at the main line coming from here. Let's embed it to wall. Okay, and then from here. Or pwede rin ilagay mo rito. Or sige coming from here ayan natap mo na yung uh, sa comfort room meron na siyang sariling gate valve okay and then naka embed sa wall yung pipe natin then tap to the fixtures this is for lavatory and then this is for the water closet okay mabilis lang or simple lang gawin and then for the host bib paano tayo maglagay ng water line niya okay from this one ito yung wind mag wag ka magkabit ng pipe after the gate valve because if key off mo rito so yung host bib hindi na masama din pag off or else itap mo uh, before the gate valve okay embed to soil Okay, iusob natin yung konti yung gate valve. Ayan. From here, okay, let's connect the gate valve. Okay, then host bib. Okay, ayan. So, ganun lang kabilis or kasimple magkawa ng uh, water line layout. Okay, wala tayong level ng gate valve. Let's make, uh, let's put a level. Okay, this one. GB. Uh, get bulb so sir bakit may tatlong get bulb okay that is uh, mas gusto ko yung may get bulb yung kanya kanyang uh, area na paglalagyan for this one yung kitchen if, uh, if gusto mong i-repair yung kitchen so let's uh, if mo lang itong get bulb without interrupting other fixtures hindi ito na apektuhan okay so, if you, you repair the comfort room, meron kang uh, improvement. So, you, you can just uh, off this gate bulb without interrupting host beam on the kitchen sink. Okay, so we have already the water line. Let's have this. Um, gawa na tayo ng uh, pipe schedule. So, ang minimum natin, you can use 20 mm uh, PPR pipe. Okay, that's 20 mm diameter. Uh, PPR pipe. PPR is poly uh, poly uh, polypropylene. Oh, PPR. Search na lang sa Google. PPR pipe PN20. Okay, kahit tong taas polypropylene ba? <laughs> PVC is polyvinyl chloride. Okay, so konting fixtures na naman to we can use this 20 mm uh, PPR or polypropylene pipe okay so ganun lang kabilis gawin yung waterline layout okay. if pwede natin i-hide uh -huh, kahit hindi na din tama to so okay wala na tayong ko lang okay to recall Again, so before you design waterline layout, lagi nyo ng legend in order for you to uh, familiarize uh, the, uh, uh, the waterline scope. Okay, from here, meron tayo nito. KS, uh, lavatory, LEB, water meter, WM, uh, host beam, it's B, waterline, PPR. Okay, so from here, meron tayong kitchen sink. Okay, isang comfort room. 
sa kaisang hospital laundry area. Kaya kaysa ganun lang kabilis gumawa ng uh, water line layout so, uh, para magmabilis to or maganda tingnan sa site. You must implement this one in accordance with the plumbing code. Okay. So, kayo, may natutunan kayo. Uh, next, let's discuss paano gumawa ng isometric ng water line. Okay. Thank you.